Maxine Waters' new insane reason to impeach Trump proves she's running out of options by Amy Moreno for truthfeednews.com. Maxine Waters is always looking for a reason to impeach President Trump. From mean tweets to telling NFL players to stop kneeling, Waters has absolutely now uh, no grasp on uh, how our system works, which adds to the uh, humor until you realize that she's getting paid for this. Now Representative Waters is calling on Trump to be impeached for withdrawing from the failed Duran deal from Town Hall. I get being against Trump, you don't like him, he's dangerous, he's sexist, he's a racist, he's not conservative, he's not a Republican. There are plenty of reasons both sides don't like this man, though he's not any of those things. And yes, he's not a conservative Republican. He's a right-leaning populist and has an agenda that gives conservative Republicans most of what they want. Yet, the resist fever that's broken out among liberal Democrats is just popcorn worthy. Representative uh, Maxine Waters has been the face of this resist at all costs wing among progressives, which has developed into a total clown show. She said the president is a ex uh, sad excuse of a man who has no business being in the White House. Oh, and he poses a constitutional threat and have generated a related uh, crisis because he's a different kind of president or something. Oh, and Trump colluded with the Russians in her mind. Waters has pledged to work day and night to get Trump impeached, even apparently in instances where such a charge wouldn't apply. It's not even grounded in reality, she thinks. She should be impeached over, uh, he should be impeached over our withdrawal from the Iran deal. Trump further isolating the United States thinks he knows better than our negotiators and all of our global allies who agreed to the Iran deal. How long do we have to suffer his gigantic ego and narcissistic behavior? Impeachment is the only answer. Trump further isolating the United States thinks uh, he knows better. Okay, we read that. Trump further, okay. Yeah, back in the real uh, world, this decision was probably one of the best in Trump's presidency. It also wasn't legally binding. He was well within his authority to do so. Screaming at the clouds might be good for fundraising and being a California liberal. Waters can and does say insane things that will yield zero political consequences. Nevertheless, it's beyond entertaining seeing how people who simply cannot accept the result of the 2016 election continue to throw tantrums. Meanwhile, Trump is on the verge of making history by helping bring uh, an end to the uh, Korea War and denuclearize, uh, denuclearizing uh, the peninsula, something that Hillary Clinton couldn't have managed unless they uh, have her foundation, uh, gave her foundation a large donation, maybe. Guy has a lengthy post about how this was a tremendous decision by the Trump White House, but he, uh, this uh, Aaron uh, Worthing, you are going to impeach Trump for, for refusing to honor a deal that wasn't binding on him? You are some kind of special stupid Maxine. Uh, that sums it up in a nutshell. She's a special kind of stupid, absolutely. And she's out there screaming and yelling and getting paid in the meantime. So I don't know what to say about this one. She should have been locked up a long uh, time ago for a mental evaluation. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. And again, thank you so much for watching.